Hey there, this is Dee with Digitech Drive and in this video I'll be reviewing an affiliate marketing tool called Lasso made for bloggers. It's actually a WordPress plugin. Lasso makes it easy to manage links, create product displays and increase your affiliate income. So this is an all-in-one marketing tool for affiliate marketers. This is the website. Let's, let's have a, a look at its features. It says you can design beautiful displays that are optimized to convert. This is an example of a display made with the Lasso plugin on a WordPress website. Um, it says you can manage all your important links in one place. Uh, create new links with keywords in two clicks. We're going to go through all the features or most of the features in the rest of this video. So stay tuned to know how lasso works and how it can be great for your blogging business it's a full suite of affiliate marketing tools you can have beautiful product displays it has an option called opportunities where you can view every unmonetized link in your article or blog and keywords across your site and instantly turn them into affiliate links you have a dashboard you have amazon integration if you're an amazon associate you have the opportunity to link your Amazon account to um, Lasso. There's a link cloaking option as well, where you can make all your URLs look pretty by adding your own custom permalink to every affiliate link. You can also organize your links into groups and use them to display a grid or list on your website. You can also do click tracking. And find out which affiliate links on your site are getting the most clicks. You can also import your links from other plugins like pre-links, thirsty affiliates and more. You can also check out the link health of your site and get notified when you have a broken affiliate link or a product you recommend is out of stock on Amazon. You also get a money back guarantee, a 30 day money back guarantee live customer support, unlimited links, no follow, no index links, and a frequently asked questions area. You can check this out if you have any questions or any doubts about this plugin. Now let's get started. If you click on get started, it's gonna take you to the pricing, you know, the different offers you have. So, there's a trial version for seven days, and then you have to pay $39 per month. And if you if you want to go big, you can just do the $389 per year deal, which is going to save you $79. So I'm going to leave the link to this in the description box below, so you can start off with the seven-day trial and see how it works. If you like the features, if they're really useful and helpful, you may want to extend so the monthly offer or the annual the annual deal okay now let's take a look at a demo video explaining the major features of lasso Right, so that was a video just explaining the major features of the lasso. Uh, let's go right into my WordPress website and see how this works. When you purchase 
the lasso plugin and install it into your WordPress site, this is what the dashboard is going to look like. So you have the dashboard with your links, the images of the links, groups, alerts, locations, opportunities, tables, and groups. Now, this is usually where you start off. You, you can click on Add New Link to add a new affiliate link. And then you paste your link here and click Add Link. So for the sake of this video, I'll just show you the links I've already added. Let's click on Skillshare, for example. When you add your new link, this is where it's going to take you to. You put in the name of the tool or the name of the software or product you like to link to. You set up your permalink. And then here is, this is where you put in your primary destination URL. This is basically your affiliate link. So you put it in here. And if you want to create a button, you can write a text, the text for that button here. As you can see in this display, get started here. This is where you write that. This is where you type it in. And then if you want to redirect to another destination, you can put it in here. And then you can assign a group to this URL. In this case, Skillshare is an online course platform. So I created a group called online course platform. You can also add other groups. These are other groups I've created. So you can assign this affiliate link to other groups in which you love it to feature. All right, and then you have the option to write out a description of the product or service you like to promote as an affiliate. Then you have this disclosure statement where you can write, hey, we earn a commission if you make a purchase, add no additional cost to you. You can leave the rest of these as default. Locations, this tells you the number of locations in which your affiliate link is found. In this case, as you can see, it said five locations. So the word Skillshare appears in five different locations in your website and it tells you exactly where in your website they are found. Okay, and it tells you the type of link. Is it a link actually? Is it a, uh, is it a display? Is it a button? Yeah, so you can see all of that here. And then opportunities are, let's say if you, if you had mentioned the word Skillshare, for example, in another blog post on your website and you forgot to insert your affiliate link, it's just going to let you know here in this opportunity step. That being said, let's move on to opportunities. All right. When you click on opportunities, you have this option, programs, keywords, and content. Under the programs tab is going to show you all the affiliate program opportunities that you could sign up for based on the mentions in your articles. So you can see, for example, I mentioned Treehouse in an, an article somewhere, potential affiliate opportunity. So I could click on sign up and it's going to take me to the Treehouse, grab my affiliate link and come back here and insert it in my article. Next up, we have keywords. You can click on the keywords tab, and this is going to help you create new links faster with keywords. So for example, the word Aweber has been mentioned a couple of times in this website, and it's been mentioned a lot of times in this article. It tells you where exactly this keyword is found. You can see it's the same article where I mentioned Aweber a couple of times, but I didn't link it to my affiliate offer. So I created an Aweber link, unique link, but I haven't monetized this link. So it just lets me know keywords that are in my articles on the website that I probably forgot to monetize. You don't want to spam, you don't want to fill up your articles with affiliate links. If you click on this, it's going to tell you, it's going to show you another mention of the word Aweber in your article and so on. So for example, if I want to monetize this particular mention of Aweber in my article, I have to click on this toggle and then search for Aweber. And there you go. This is the Aweber link I had added already. I just have to click on monetize. And there you go. This link is already monetized in that article. 
on the website. And you can do this for several mentions of other keywords. If there were other keywords, you're going to see them here and exactly where they're located in your article and you can choose to monetize them. Next up, we have the content tab. It brings out a list of um, all your articles, all the content on your website that has links in them. And it tells you the number of links. So you can click on, let's say, um, let's click on this, the best trading online course platforms of 2022. It says there are 25 links in this article. So you can click on that to see the 25 links in the article. And it's going to tell you which ones are monetized and which aren't. As you can see, these are the 25 links here. You can move on to the next tab to see all of them. So these ones that have been toggled green are the links in that article that have been monetized. And these ones that are grayed out are links that haven't been monetized. So if I want to monetize this link, all I have to do is click on this. That's for Thinkific. Come and type in here. Search. And there you go. Ta-da! And that link is monetized. And you can do that for several other keywords, article content and stuff in your website. So this is a wonderful tool. You have the option to create tables and groups as well and monetize your products. You see, you can create a table. These are a few tables I've created already. You can clone tables. You can add products to your tables and see what they look like. You can also click on groups to add groups. So you can see these are a few groups I created. Uh, let's look at the dropshipping group. There are three links in the group. Well, it's just going to tell you what products are in that group. And then you can see the display on your website when you're done. This is a blog post on the website, the best business toolkit for online entrepreneurs. So if you scroll down, you're going to see the groups which I created and how they're displayed. So you have the email marketing platform group. See how it's displayed. You can change the display. You can put it in columns or row. Uh, best online course platforms. This is another category and so on. So you see the different displays you have. You can change it out a little bit. You can you see you can have the, the column option instead of the row option. And a lot of flexibility. It's so beautiful. It makes your products stand out in your website and look more attractive to your audience guys i hope you enjoyed this video and i assure you lasso is a great plugin for affiliate marketers if you want to try it out just check out the link in the description box below you can sign up for a seven day free trial and let me know how it goes in the comment section if you have any questions just drop them there and i'll answer as soon as i can don't forget to subscribe for more reviews more videos you like to see like this any recommendations you have feel free to let me know in the comment section thank you